fall off. If y'all don't start commenting and sharing and subscribing, it's going to be me and y'all. Yeah. Stop playing with me. Comment. Hello, my fault. Go to the video. Hello. Some of that royalty. Oh my God. Time is it? Alexa, what time is it? The time is 11.40 a.m. Oh, I've been working since 8 a.m. I don't feel like working no more. Baby, you want to go out to eat? Sure. Alexa, turn my lights off. Okay. Yeah. What's up, y'all? So I know y'all can get valet. You know what I'm saying? You can go out to eat, get valet. That's cute. But can you do it anytime you want to? You dig what I'm saying? He about to open the door for you, baby. <laughs> Good. How are you? See y'all, I know y'all can go eat out wherever you please, right? But the question is, do you get paid for it? Do you get paid to live this lifestyle you want to live? Because I do. This meal is about to cost me about $200. I'm going to get it back. That's the whole point. Get that check and get it right back. Need that. Mmm. Uh. Mmm. Mmm. -hmm. That's the one. Ah, let's taste the steak. Mmm. Oh, look at that. You can just dive right in. Let me uh, dip it over in. I'm gonna dip it over in. Mmm. 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 Now, let's not get anything misconstrued. Before I did any of that, I had to wake up early. I had to read a book to make sure I get my mind ready for the day. I had to meditate. I had to work out. I had to make sure I was prepared for the day also so I could prepare for my night when I live stream for y'all as well. Y'all listen, I'm not going to keep you long, but I want you to know that I'm starting Crown Creators Academy March 17th. That is the day that your lives can change. I just need you to sign up and hear me out. You dig what I'm saying? All I need is you. All I need is you. I got enough up here to supply you with whatever it is you need. Just give me a chance. I love y'all, man. See y'all March 17th. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Nick G, the host. And today, I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying? And what the goddamn hell y'all leagues? So, uh, Krishan did a live last night and today. Uh, so, we probably about to just get into both of them. But y'all make sure y'all tap into um, crowncreatorsacademy.com. You dig? Teach y'all how to do YouTube and all that. Let's get it. Stop trying to be... <sighs> I, me and my nigga be beefing. He just be beefing. I'm just like, what are we beefing for? That's why he just be drunk and hurt. <laughs> I'm just like, I was supposed to be the drunk and hurt one, but alright. <laughs> <laughs> she talking her shit now. Look <laughs> at the tweet, and I'm just like, stop trying to beef with your <laughs> on Twitter. It's getting very weird like what, what the is you she said i thought i was the drunk and uh emotional one but okay <laughs> like damn i can't even enjoy being pregnant you want to suck all the happiness out of you at parties you think i don't got control over your body, that's our baby. That's your body becomes our body. Your life becomes our life. I was like, since when, motherfucking where? Not your body get, becomes my body. I get all what he's saying, but I don't get it. I don't even. I don't even condone that. Shit. Talking about some. Your body becomes my power. Head what? Let's do my check. I'm pushing this by myself. Facts. And then why are you trying to me? Like, can we just not be arguing right now? You acting like, like, what are we doing? When it's like that one disconnect that... Yo, Krishan went live. I see now. She really did not have on a bra. <laughs> At all. Shirt just open. What did they take this? Let me look and see if I got that live on the down. Okay, it could be a seed, it could be whatever. 
Don't be saying, oh, you need to watch what you're doing. No, how about we both watch what we're doing? If we don't work out, we don't work out. Don't be, don't be telling me. Like, I don't know. Like, we all know this is your body, but chill the fuck out. You, you over there gonna be like, well, throwing up shit I did. Like, last time I checked. Oh, she had on the bra? Who, what we, what uh, we Oh, shit, I'm already down on the bed. We whatever we are. We just. Four, four, four in the chat. Loving each other. We don't gotta like make it too complicated that it's unfair. Like he'd be like, bro, this and this and that. I'm just like, oh damn. Go run it back to whoever you talking about, cause that's not me. It's not me. I don't know how to be somebody I'm not. So she is pretty. That's why he hated. And he trying to bring her down. That one, two, seven tattoos. You, he, when a nigga keep repeating the same thing, you know they trying to get under your skin. <laughs> After a while, see, one thing about women, you become numb to the shit. You know what I'm saying? You, somebody done got you together. You got yourself together. Like, bitch, you that bitch. Don't ever. Don't ever. <laughs> Hold on. I got seven tattoos. I'm pregnant. I got one tooth. But you claiming me. So who's really the bad one here? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm this is how I come. You know what I'm saying? So who who's who's worse, me or you? <laughs> but see, women gotta know that. You know what I'm saying? But she know. Dude, I don't even know why he want to argue. She don't want to put that too. Okay, back he want to argue. I don't know why. Like, I don't know. Cause when she put a tooth in, then, then I don't I'm, know. You I can't say too know. many one tooths no more. What do we? Y'all, I would have been had a tooth. You would have had to screw that motherfucker in. I'm talking Ben, Ben. I would have got veneers, whole new mouth. <laughs> I would have had a whole new mouth. You ain't gonna ever one tooth me again. Let me tell you something. Go and take this other one out so we can screw two of them together. That way it won't be bothering me. You know what I'm saying? Because I feel like it was bothering her. I don't know why the hell they gave her a tooth that had a whole bunch of shit in the back of it. I don't understand that. And then she got his dumb ass on the tooth. Girl, get you a whole new set of veneers. There's a lot of snag of tooth veneer people out here. Girl, bye. I, with a bean, I'm talking pearly. <laughs> One tooth me, oh, all right. She gotta know how to boss up on this nigga, but he's it's sick cool already. When they do it, it's a problem when I do it. You feel me? Like, I don't know if it's that. Yeah, I could be rambling. Cause that's my mind, like, hey, where am I go? Her gums look nasty. First, we arguing like about something else. Then it go to, oh, it's all. And he look like he stank. Fuck him. My fault, I'm like, all right. Then it goes to, well, here you go with throwing the next bitch up. If I throw the next up, you're going to be on social media crying. Like, let's not throw up people. We don't want to hurt each other's feelings. Two, what the f is we beefing for? Like, what the f If you got... Boy, I would have been Cardi B to the whole situation. Got a bag and fix, got a bag and fix my teeth. Did she say something like them hoes ain't cheap? Listen. I would have got, I'm talking the best veneer uh, shop you can find. Put me on. I will promote your motherfucking ass, whatever it is you need to give me that perfect mouth. Okay. And I'm talking every chance I get. <laughs> Like what? You tripping? Options. I got options. She rather if you keep. Weigh your options, all right? Let me weigh mine. Don't be over there playing. Like I love you, but you can't be just playing. Like you 
They ain't trying to say you own me because we having a baby. <laughs> What you want to so this it can be like a physical so thing. Sandra, I'm hello. To the clinic to get rid of the baby. Oh, new and teeth. I'm not, <laughs> I don't know what's the argument. <laughs> the whole new teeth. Do you hear me? Tooth is just on goddamn. <laughs> just laughing shit for no reason. <laughs> You know you laugh through your teeth. That's some shit, Sassandra. <laughs> well, I'm talking. <laughs> you but what we ready? Real. But what we ready to do? <laughs> I don't even know what to like say to this. He be flexing this muscle, and I be like, "Damn, what are you flexing it for? Your pride that hurt." I'm thinking. You play that way, I play this way, we good. You want, like, you're not even sad. And I get it, you're not about to have bitches, a bitch moving loose and, and she got your kid. That group was so far, my It really did, because if you move how you want to move, you feel me? This be okay to receive the same action from yeah. me. Like, I'm a beautiful young bitch. Like, I'm not about to be, like, you know what I'm saying? I don't mm. know. Anybody like, with common sense, get it. What the fuck is Yeah, that nigga on? crazy. Like, let's just have fun. We not even having fun. You, you want to get so serious. We arguing about who body and who baby this is. Like, it's our body. It's my, our baby. It's our... Okay, then act like it. It's the it's our not, body for me. Let's kick back and have fun. What the? F that shit is crazy. That's why I'm just like, this role and this fit for the bitches you probably still with while you with me. Like, what are we doing? Why are we pretending? Like, you know, I love passion, I love hard, yeah, but it comes to a point when, like, he's scared for her one, two, seven tattoo pregnant ass to go out here and run into a real nigga. That's all, y'all. And he is really, really, really slowing down the process when he get on the internet and he get to talking that shit about her until. One of them niggas on the internet don't give a fuck about none of that. Listen, baby, I don't give a damn about none of that. He can say whatever he want to say. So can the world. I want you. You know, a nigga move a mountain for a woman he want for real. So he's trying to control her with the condescending ass statements like, on schoolyard crib, you fuck a nigga and I fuck a bitch, then I gotta do the double stand. How can you, how do you have to do the double standard when it was already a double standard? Like, I fuck a bitch and, and, and you go out and fuck a nigga, then I'ma have to fuck a bitch. He really just said that, y'all. You go out and f I'll go out and fuck a bitch and then I come back, you fuck a nigga, then I'ma have to play, uh, what'd he say? Tip for tat and fuck another bitch again. <laughs> I'm already hurt by the first one. The second one is not even going to matter. You already hurt me already. I'm done. Women stop at the first one. Oh my God. I'm already hurt. She ain't never forgot that one. So the ones that come after that really don't matter. <laughs> like for real. If you don't feel like, then I'm not trying to say be your only bitch. I don't want to be your only bitch if that's not what you want. Oh. I don't want to be... <laughs> You're all in all if that's not what you want. But don't come over here acting like I gotta do everything like like what? You want me to be lonely till you get back? Or uh -huh. do what you do? Like That's exactly I don't what he know wants. what it, like alright, so say if you go outside yeah. and he alright, like alright, for for example, AZ. All right, all right, all right. He go out to AZ, first I go to AZ, I'm like, yeah, I'm on my way to AZ because you're not responding, you playing with me, woo, when, right? Yeah. So, 
I'm like, okay, let me beat him to AZ because he think I'm playing. Like, I'm going right. to see him. I'm going to see him. Then, right. like, as I'm traveling, yeah. I'm like, I don't know. Traveling is like a stress-free thing. By the time I got on the flight, by the time I landed, and he was like, he had an Airbnb but want me to buy a hotel. I'm like, okay, I'm Ooh. outside. You can go be at the Airbnb with your homies and with random-ass groupies. By all means, that's beautiful. Have fun. So when I get to having fun, and then next in my face, not like that, but nobody really was in my face. Ain't no way in the fuck I'm about to. At some point, y'all, I know you, you 23, shit don't matter. But, okay, because I was 22 and did some real dumb shit. So when you mad about some shit, right, and you own the way to the shit that you mad at, now, it's going to take me about five minutes to change my mind. Ain't no way in the fuck I'm buying a flight to Arizona because this nigga in Arizona and he want to be with groupies and niggas. Have fun. I am in Miami <laughs> with somebody's boyfriend. Okay. Ooh, child, I'm telling y'all, God knew. I don't feel like I stepped out of line because stepping out of line is fucking. Stepping out of line is really like going there with a motherfucker. Like, really going there. I ain't going there with nobody. But, yeah, I was at, like, a party, an after party, 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 party. And he blowing me up, like, bitch, you this and this and that. And I'm like, bro, you just was stalling. Like, we not about to be acting like you just didn't want to hang out with me. And that's cool. Just be cool when it's time for me to have fun. Like, that shit not cool with him. And I don't know. Like, lately I've been chilling. I've been in the house. I've been pregnant. This I've been... <sighs> Letting this little thing grow inside me, like this thing be hurting me sometimes. I be having cramps and shit. I thought I was having a mess. My homegirl, like, oh no, bitch, that's because your your stomach getting fake bigger. Like it's growing inside. It's going to cramp up, ho. Like it's contractions. I was like, damn. I'm not even feeling it for real. Like I'm extra sensitive. I'm extra like extra extra extra. Like and then I'm like on his ass a little bit. Like, I feel like I'm unfair to him, but I'm like, damn, this is an unfair relationship. I can't really come over here emotionally. I don't know. Like, uh -oh. I can't really come to you. Oh, my God. I hate when I'm about to cry. I can't really come over here and really feel like, like, I don't know. It's not a safe zone with you. We still in like, okay, cool. Then I play the whole, like, all right. I'm brushing it off. I'm keeping it sh straight dry. Like, I don't even want to really be around yo sometimes. So, we get to, he acting like, yeah, you acting like how you acting. Like, bitch, I'm pregnant. What's up? You want to be pregnant too? Like, what's up? Like, do you know what this shit feel like? Oh, why right, then, like, then play it cool. If not, my is happy alone. You feel me? Like, we be arguing about how I be acting dry when I'm not dry. It's like sometimes things just really like bother you. So you just be fucked up all day, probably for two days straight. And it's something really growing inside you. You can't really smoke. You can't drink it away. You can't do nothing. You just got to sit there with all those fucked up emotions. Like She won't be alone soon. Soon she's going to have her little bundle of joy. She's gonna have a forever friend in a minute. That's what I hate about him. Like, this pregnancy shit. He trying to be like fake cold. Like, cause we, and I'm like, yo, well, my mama, like, what you want me to afford it so bad? Then we shouldn't be talking. The f what we talking for? Like, what we talking for? Then he go back to, I love you and all this other shit. Like, he. He got this big ass soft box for me, but then he got this bitterness to him. Then he got this, I, I can't take back, I can't take the fact that you allow this to happen. I'm just like, you a nigga that's allowing it to happen. What you mean? You over there acting loose, acting like you don't need to know my whereabouts, who I'm with, what I'm doing. So nigga don't, you feel me? So when I play his game back, it's like all hell broke loose. I'm like, yo, what the f is this? This like a, childish ass high school relationship and um, none of my relationships in high school was like this like if anything i was the heartbroker if anything it wasn't heartbroken if anything nobody cheated on me like i don't know i've never played these games before with anybody in my entire life so for me to be going through this and then you in dubai like i'm in another state we both making some type of money for each other or whatever 
cool. The positive note, everything is cool. I just don't get like he then like all right. Say if I'm mad for something, and if I'm mad for too long, he start dragging it. Like all right, since you mad, let me flip this all on you. Like boy. Y'all, they don't belong together. They need to go ahead and let it go and let it let it be. But y'all let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.